What's up YouTube? Today I'm going to show you how to make a good watermark and put it in your HD videos. So you're going to make a new document in Adobe Fireworks CS3 or CS4, it works with both. So you're going to make a new document, go to file new and make it 95 by 95 pixels and make it transparent for the canvas color. Just cancel that. So next what you got to do is hold down, press and hold your left clicker on your mouse and you could select these options and click ellipse tool hotkey U so next what you gotta do is hold down shift and then drag and make a perfect circle now I'm gonna just put that right there okay next thing you gotta do is make it black or whatever color you wanna make it blue, green, doesn't matter and let me just make this a tiny bit smaller. It doesn't matter what size of your watermark. Now, what you gotta do is add the border, stroke, whatever you guys call it. So you gotta go here and click white or whatever color you want it. Make that about six. Now, you want to add a shadow, an inner shadow. It's like that shadow effect. So, you're going to go to filters, shadow and glow, inner shadow. Now, you're going to make this about like the third one, third gray color here. Three right there. Okay. And set the blur amount to zero. Now you could just position the shadow. I think 300 is fine. Now, as you can see, it's over the the border, so a stroke or whatever. Now, what you want to do is make another circle. About the same size. And you're gonna set the color to nothing, the transparent button. Now you're gonna set that right there. Okay, you're gonna set it over the the first um circle you made. Click on the first circle, go to inner shadow and make that about 29. Now you got your shadow and you could add some text. I'll just put VV. Sorry. And by the way, this font is called Slant, so you could go to defont.com and download that. Just make that like about that big and you could make Go to fill options and look at gradient and change the colors around. I look at black and red. Two favorite colors. Just, you know, change the font or something. You know what to do, so let's just change this. So you got your logo. I know mine is kind of ugly, but it's just, just like an example. So what you want to do is go to File, Save As. You can save it as a PNG, and I'll just name an example. And click Save. Now what you want to go to is Camtasia Studio 6. So you want to import some media. Now I'll just import my last video. I think it was my last video on my YouTube partnership features. So just add your your clip to the timeline. Just edit, do everything, do whatever you want with the video, play it over anything. Then what you gotta go to is produce video as. Click, then you could 
and you're gonna go to add edit preset click new and I'm just gonna name this example then you should make that WMV or a quick time your choice I like a WMV so next click next make that OVD by 20 and you're at the video options click include watermark on the wa watermark and then click options it would give you this preview and then you could X that out click it again click open and browse the watermark we just made go this right here example click open and as you can see it's right there you could click preserve image size that would make it bigger and you could put the opacity higher um, put the image scale higher and emboss I like keeping it normal so yep cancel that and so yeah that's it for today thanks for watching this video please rate comment and subscribe more tutorials coming up check out my website for more updates and news